Hey everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel. My name is Mel and I'm the lead bar fitness educator here at Bar Fitness. Today I have with me co-founder and creator of Bar Fitness, Ella, and the corporate general manager, Jade. And we're really excited. This is our first Total Body Express class. So what you need for this class, a water bottle if you have one, some weights, if you don't have weights, feel free to get creative, pick up those cans, heavy water bottles, whatever you have lying around the house. Um, and then we also do have a mat, so if you have a yoga mat, whatever you feel, maybe even if it's just carpet, that's gonna work out really well. Um, remember, listen to your body, so if anything you need to modify, feel free to take the lower impact options and I will cue this as we go along. So ladies, let's get started. Nice wide feet here, second position. We're gonna start with a nice short warm up here, so make sure you're a little bit warmed up before this. Wide second position, big breath in. Reach up overhead, exhale, wrist roll down to the floor. You have one more like this, big breath in, reach. Exhale, wrist roll, toes point forward here, round your spine, reach forward. And then exhale as you lift back up. Let's take one more breath here. Inhale, reach forward. Exhale as you rise back up. Now walk those feet right underneath you, stack the arms, knees go right to left. Here we go, take it right and left. So as you lift those legs, I want you to start to pay attention to your core. So you want to feel your abdominal muscles start to hug in. Those are your supporter muscles, keeping your back nice and safe, nice and happy. You have a few more. Let's go for it. Three, we're going to swing that left arm forward, right arm side. Reach and reach. Reach nice and long through those fingertips. Let's just four. Three, arms are going to go up nice wide. We cut eight, seven. Now in six, we're going to take a twist. Cut four, three, two, twist to the side. We go up and down and switch and switch. Now as you rotate, start to hug those waist muscles in. Can you grow a little bit taller here? You have eight, seven, six, five. Remember to have fun. Put a little smile on. Last two and last one. Release. All right. Pick up those weights and let's get started. So we're using three pound weights. Feel free to use twos. Feel free to use fives. Whatever you feel like today. We're going to start with a lunge. So step one foot forward. Take that other leg back and come onto the ball of the foot. Weights right over top of elbows. Let's bring those elbows together. Bend those knees. Take it down and up. Get nice and low. So a few things here are really important. You're keeping that front knee right over top of your ankle. That's it. Let's go for four more. Take down four. Exhale for three. Bring it in for two. Now hold this next one nice and low. We're going for a pulse here. Those elbows are lifting nice and small. You want to see that number 11 here with your forearms. You have eight, seven, six, five. Now in four, we're going to hinge forward for reverse flies. Hinge forward. Take it down. And lift. Now, if you want to add on today, I want you to point that back foot. Add a lift of that back leg and rise. You have four. Squeeze for three. And lift. Two more here. Two. Take your next one to the top. Tiny little pulse to squeeze. Lift. So what we're doing here is we're squeezing our glute muscles. We're drawing our shoulder blades together on our back. Let's go for eight more. Let's do eight. Seven. In six, we're going to take that right leg out nice and wide. Setting up for a squat. Here we go. Take it down. Weights to chest. Rise. Straight down to the floor. Free to pause this video at any point if you need to take breaks. You have four more, four. Nice and three. We're gonna take this arm, we're gonna reach it over on the diagonal. Here we go, eight times. Reach up, same thing. And reach, now if you want a little extra side booty, I want you to lift that leg up to the side. You have four. Find your balance for three. Get in two, we're gonna go over to the other side. Here we go, take it down, inhale, exhale. Press off the floor. Keep your weight back into your heels here. You have four. Up. Nice for three. Good. In two, we're going to squat down. We're going to send both weights up. Heels stay down. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. By this point, your heart rate should be up a little bit. Okay, ladies, are we feeling it? Yes. You have four. Good. For three, let's take two. Let's take a few pulses here. Why not get low? A bar we're all about those tiny little movements. This should be hitting your challenge zone. So you should really start to feel that burn. You have eight. Seven, six, last four, three, two, and last one, walk it in. Good, roll those shoulders back, don't worry, we don't have to do that move again. But we are gonna start with some shoulders on the other side. So step that other leg back, find your full post, and let's begin, elbows in and out. And rise, keep going, that's it. So you can see, she's elbows really resisting those elbows, drawing them together, really trying to move the shoulders. Let's take two more here. Take one more now, pull it at the bottom, little pulses. That's it, Jay. Resist, resist. Core is firing nice and strong. Stay with it, you have eight more. Eight, seven, in six. We're gonna rotate the palms to face us for this next set. Three, two, hinge forward. We take it down and up. So you turn to my side. 
You have the option, ladies, to pick up that back leg. But you can see my body here, diagonal line. Even the neck here, you have two more. Two, hold this one at the top. Little pulses, squeeze that booty. Keep it going. Woo! Last eight seconds, we push. Eight, seven, squeeze a little smaller, a little higher. You're done in four, three, two, and last one. Roll those shoulders back, great right job, ladies. So if you wanna pick up heavier weights, go for it. We're gonna work those biceps and our quads. So bring your heels together, turn those feet out, first position. We're gonna lift those heels two inches off the floor. Shoot. Bring those heels all the way together, and then bend your knees into a nice diamond. Bring your elbows right alongside your rib cage. Let's go for a curl. We go down an inch and lengthen. So the arms are gonna go full range of motion. Your legs are moving small. And I want you to resist. Imagine you had 100 pounds in your arms. Resist, squeeze, right? And resist, squeeze. Now, if you need a modification, you can always keep the heels on the floor, or you can you can help them stand on the mat. Let's go for a four. Exhale for three. Take a look for two. Pull this next one down. Squeeze those biceps. Squeeze. This is an isometric contraction. We're squeezing our bicep muscles. Flex. Pulse those hips down. Eight more here. Eight. In seven, we're gonna rotate those palms to face each other. Grab our curls. Let's go in three, two, right here. We bend down, lengthen. Can you come a little bit lower? I know you can. Please. That's it. Working those stronger muscles in our body. Burning up more energy here. Let's take eight more. Eight. That's it. Exhale. Are we feeling it? Woo! I hope so. <laughs> Four more. Four. Exhale for three. I'm starting to feel that shape. You two. Take this one halfway. Last 16 pulses. Making the best pulses you've ever done. Squeeze those biceps down. Hold. A little lower. Smile. It'll help convince yourself that you're having a good time. Last eight. Seven. Knees a little wider. Squeeze. For four. Three. Two. And last one. Oh. All right. Take those weights. We're going to place them just to our side. Keep them close by because we're going to use them at the end. So we're going to come into a high plank. So come down onto your mat. You're gonna take your wrists, bring them right underneath your shoulders, and then step one foot back at a time. So in our plank position, you really wanna feel your transverse dominance. So that's a fancy word for your deep core. You know when you're walking across the beach, you have a small baby sit on, that extra little hug in your core. So hug it in, lift up your pelvic floor, now come down into those forearms. Take it down to the ground. That's it, amazing. So if you need, you can always lower those knees down towards the floor. From here, we're gonna transfer into a side plank. So bring your forearm parallel to the front of your mat. Take your top arm up, now drop your bottom knee to the floor. Point your top toes, let's lower those hips. Take them down, and nice, inhale. Exhale, that's it, keep going. And squeeze, so we're squeezing into the waist, connect into your back, and then into that side booty. And lift for four, rise, good for three. You have two. We're gonna lift that top leg as our hips go up now. So you're gonna go down, lift the leg. Down, lift the leg. Oh yeah. Reach and reach. Nice and big. Lift and lift. Two more here. Two. You're gonna take the next one to the top. Top leg pulses. This is your last 16 here. Lift that waist line up a little bit higher. You have eight, seven, six, five. Last four, a little harder. Three, two, and one. Release down. All right, we have to do the other side now. So let's start in that high plank. Swivel your legs around. From here, we're gonna come into a high plank. Wrist right underneath, shoulders down. Really spread those fingers wide. Send one foot back at a time. And then bring your arm back in the middle. Find that zipper from the cubic bone to bone. That was lifting up your belly. And then from here, lower down towards your forearms. One at a time. Take it down, pull for a few breaths. Connect into your back here. Now bring that forearm parallel to the front of the mat. Turn to face me. That's it, reach that top arm up. Now let's lower that bottom knee. Here we go, we take the hips down, press. So right into your oblique side of your waistline. And lift. These muscles are our waist. Yes, they look amazing when they're strong, but they're also really important for supporting those back muscles. Let's go for two more. We're gonna point the top foot. When you're ready, we're gonna add a lift. And rise, tap, and rise, inhale. Four more here, four, and lift. All right, three. You have two. Let's go for those tiny little pulses right here. Let's squeeze up 
and up, right into that side booty. Woo! Little pulses, eight more. You eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job, now I have one more thing for you. We're gonna work those chest muscles and we're gonna work our glutes one more time because who doesn't want a strong booty? All right, so take your weights, reach them forward, sit in the front of your mat, inhale, as you exhale, scoop your abdominal muscles to get a nice slow C curve. That round shape in the spine is where your back over to the floor. Right now from here, slide your hips forward on your mat. Heel toe your feet out wide. So remember that second position we started off with. Toes towards the front corners of your mat. Now bend your elbows like a goal post. Let's start slow here. Take two counts, press arms and hips up. And then lower back down. That's it. Exhale, relax. Inhale to lower. Now as you lift those weights up, think of squeezing the weights together. So we get a little more chest to reach. Let's take it a little faster now. Here we go. Exhale, press, lower, press, lower. Reach it up. That's it, ladies. Really squeeze those glutes. I hope you're having a good time at home. Keep it going. Two more times. Now take your next one to the very top and pause. Open those arms halfway down towards the floor. Keep those hips up. Let's pulse. Little push and push. So as you pulse, create more contraction into the chest muscles. Resist. Resist. A little higher with those hips. Find that diagonal line from knee hip to shoulder. So eight, seven, six, five. Let's round those arms. Now as you lower, lower everything to the floor. Let's go second round. Single counts. Rise like you're giving somebody a big hug. That's it. And squeeze. Inhale. Exhale. For four. For three. I have something special at the end here. Pull this one at the very top. Open those arms up. Lift right. those heels. Take it. Let's pull. Squeeze. And squeeze hips a little higher. Resist those arms towards each other. Come on, you can do this. Last eight seconds. Eight, seven, six, five. Squeeze more. Four, three, two, and you can lower all the way down. Take those weights, place them to the side. I'm gonna give you a quick little glute stretch here to recover. Cross your right knee over your left like you're sitting on a chair. Knees come into chest, reach up for those shins, and gently bring your knees in towards you. Take a few deep breaths here. As always, make sure that you're stretching at home a little bit longer. We do have a stretch video on our YouTube channel, so definitely see if you can check that out. Um, and ladies, you can switch sides, like, subscribe to our channel, feel free to leave a comment. Um, and then if this wasn't hard enough for you, I want you to do it two more times. Thank you so much. Take care, bye-bye.